Hey guys, my name is Luis. Welcome back to Rusted Horsepower. So real quick update on where I've been the past couple of months. I had this plan to shoot all these videos and I did shoot a couple of them. They were in the process of getting edited. At the same time, I decided to get basically my routine doctor's visits and getting my health up to date. So, through somewhat of a routine CT scan that I had, they found a tumor on my right lower kidney. This tumor is currently dormant. It's not affecting any of the organs or anything around it. They actually don't even know if it's benign or malignant. For the time being, they're calling it renal cell carcinoma until proven otherwise. So basically that's saying they're labeling it cancer until it's proven not to be. The doctors say it's pretty favorable. It's small, it's favorable position. Everything is favorable about it. It's basically caught early. Now we've had, on my wife's side, we've had our run-ins with cancer. We've lost family members. We've had near, near misses. So this news hits us pretty hard. It hit me pretty hard. The main thing I was concerned about was my family. I have six children. My youngest is two years old. So in my eyes, they're still babies. My wife is a stay-at-home mom. So the way we've always done things is I'm the main income earner. And the thought of me being taken out of this world early, it, it just hits us hard. I mean, I feel like I'm not done protecting them, watching out for them, looking out for them, raising them, providing for them. I had a lot of issues with it. I didn't even want to talk about it. I honestly couldn't put on a smiling face and shoot videos. What really helped me was, at the same time, I was trying not to think about it. We were spending a lot of family time. Went camping, which we hadn't done in a while, and did stuff like that. I was also taking long walks and praying and talking to God. He answered me. I got a rush of emotion, and the answer I got was, I got you, and you will pass through this. That to me tells me a nurturing, hey, I got you, don't worry about it. You'll pass through this, meaning, just like the Bible says, this too shall pass. You're going to survive this. That put me at ease. That helped me open up. Once I got past that, then I could go ahead and talk about it and deal with it. All options were on the table. So, my wife and I sat down and talked about it. And what we thought was best for my age is a partial nephrectomy, which is partial removal of the lower right kidney. Now it does come with risks. This is going to be done robotically, minimal intrusion, four or five punctures in my lower back. And the robot's going to go in there and do all the cutting, suturing and all that stuff, controlled by the surgeon. The risks are that if for any reason something goes wrong, they're going to have to cut me open. They're going to have to do the surgery the old-fashioned way, which is going to cause more downtime and more recovery time. Another risk is if bleeding can't be controlled or something goes wrong in that area, they're going to have to remove the entire kidney. These are minimal risks compared to having cancer, possible cancer in my body. So that's the route we decided to do. Surgery is set to be Thursday, July 29th, in just a couple of days. And the way my wife and I have always attacked life is, and I've even told her this, it's just me and you against the world. We don't ask anybody for anything. We don't depend on anybody for anything. We just do everything on our own. And we raise our children the same way. Right now, the only thing I'm going to ask for is prayer. I need some prayer warriors in my camp. 
I'm going to ask for prayer that the surgery goes without any problems. That when they do test the tumor, that it's not cancer. And for a good recovery and stability in my family. That's all I ask for. Sincerely, I also want to say thank you for watching my channel. Thank you for watching my videos. And as soon as this is all over with, I will post more videos. For the time being, thank you. God bless you. Thank you.